<laughs> hey guys, we're at Spin New York City Ping Pong Bar and Lounge. Um, we're here to meet Wu Yu and let's go see what she's all about. All right, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My company is SimX. Uh, my name is Corey Simino and I've been an independent distributor for Shackley. Uh, I've been taking their products for over 10 years now um, and have been healthy overall since. I'm here with my friends Jalen and John. Um, Jalen's actually <clears throat> a brand new distributor with Shackley and I'll be coming out with an intro video soon for him uh, to, to introduce him a little bit. Um, I'm brand new to this so please bear with me. Um, I'm here with Miss Yu Wu. Um, she's 2015 Pan American Champion for teams and singles events. She uh, competed for US for in the uh, 2016 Rio Games and North American Cup and she's actually the 35th best table tennis player in the world so that's awesome um, thanks thanks for coming on the channel um, so tell me a little bit about yourself and how you got started playing table tennis okay so when I was eight, I started table tennis at uh, eight years old and uh, because at that time my eye vision was really bad so my mom asked her co-worker to you know like what kind of sport can can improve my eye region, and then that's how I start table tennis. One quick question before we get started. Do you prefer ping pong or table tennis? Because I know I've heard from a couple other people that some table tennis players get a little offended when you call yeah. it ping pong. Yeah, I prefer, I personally prefer table tennis because this is kind of like real table, you know, like real sport. Ping mm -hmm. pong just like everyone can play. Yeah, yeah. gotcha. Okay. So I'll call it table tennis now. Um, so can you talk to the, can you tell the audience a little bit about your routine for training when you train for, let's say, Olympic Games or any other um, championship games for table tennis? Can you talk about your routine, uh, your day-to-day -day routine for training? Yeah, uh, usually right now I play a lot of pro tours. Mm -hmm. I, play, I play a lot of competitions. And then also uh, at least one or two times a day for training. Okay. Yeah. So. It, when you train those one or two times, is it kind of like, um, you know, is it like for three, four hours, five hours long um, each time or what? what? I think uh, maybe probably around two hours. Two hours. Yeah, wow. per, per time and then also plus the physical training. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you lift weights or like run or? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. Um, so can you talk about who like some of the people that you look up to maybe um, anybody that it's like a role model or anything yeah. like that? Uh, I think my role model is uh, her name is Zhang Yining. She was the Olympian champions and then she won a lot of titles. So I think she's for personality she's very nice and then she was from Beijing team also. Mm -hmm. So we're kind of like not teammate but she's much older but uh, both of us from Beijing team and uh, I'm very proud of her and also I think she's my role model. Oh, that's cool. Have you ever met her? Yeah, yeah. Okay. We practice sometimes before. You do? Yeah. Wow, that's awesome. I flipped on the television yesterday mm -hmm. and I noticed that they have a new thing called the Aurora Games and it's like for the empowerment of women, uh, yeah. women's sports. Um, and I noticed that you actually played in it. Yeah. I, I didn't get to see you on TV but mm -hmm. I, I only watched, I think it was women's volleyball, but I noticed that you competed in the women's table tennis portion yeah. of it. Can you explain a little bit about that in the Aurora Games? Uh, it's very honor to be there to play the Aurora Games. Uh, I just feel like uh, I want more people or kids or, you know, like just people to join this sport because it's very fun, you know, like, yeah, yeah. everyone, you just have a table and then you can, you two people and then you can play. You, competed in, in like many types of informs and types of uh, international games and the WTTC, the World Table, Tampi Table Tennis Championship. Um, can you explain about your competitions there? Um, you know, how you did, uh, what it was like? Uh, I, I represent to play for US uh, since 2017 for mm -hmm. the World, World Championships. Um, so in 2017, me and my teammate Lily Zhang, we, we made the quarterfinals for doubles. That's pretty good. Last year was a team event, and then we did uh, 13th in mm -hmm. the world. Wow. Yeah, so 
uh, th- there's uh, so many events, uh, mm. levels, how to say that, maybe, oh, division, division. So there's uh, uh, many divisions, with, so U.S. is the first division. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. You guys think you can do uh, 13th? Um, in the world. <laughs> so uh, we're gonna we're gonna now jump into the kind of like the the Shackley realm. So can you talk about when you joined the Shackley performance team? How you got started? How they ask you maybe and um, what products they send you and what you picked out? Um, so I think I so my our uh, our high performers. Uh, he introduced us to for the Shakley in 2016. Uh, mm-hmm. I think I we we can pick up the the products we like, right? Yep. And then I think the bar is very good. Actually. Yeah, the snack bar is really good. Yeah. I'm gonna show a picture of it right upper right corner. By the way, <laughs> I've I've been meaning to ask you, and I think the audience wants to know. Um, I know you're trying to get selected, qualified. They haven't selected anyone yet for the U.S. for the U.S. team for yeah. the table tennis. Um, what are your future plans with table tennis uh, with, you know, Tokyo 2020 coming up and even after that? So right now I'm, I'm trying very hard to make the 2020 Olympic Games. Uh, and then after that, I think, I think this is my last Olympic Games. Really? I want to be a coach, like, first. Okay, and that's then, cool. Yeah. And then any jobs just related about table tennis. So besides table tennis, I know like that takes up pretty much all your time. Um, what what other hobbies and other things besides table tennis that you like you'd like to do or you enjoy oh. doing? I think because after training, it's like kind of tired. Mm-hmm. So I prefer to watch more some movies or TV shows, uh, and then maybe hang out with my friends. So do you have any tips or tricks for the audience, like they can up their game in table tennis or get a little bit better? Uh, yeah, so the serves is very important mm. because we serve and receive is the, the, those two things. We, this is how we start table tennis. Mm. So I think if people, you can like spend more time for the serve and receive, you can improve your games 100% sure. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Yeah. Don't forget your serve receive. I'm sorry, by the way. Um, we're at we're in Spin, New York, uh, of course. I'll yeah. talk about it a little earlier in the video. And uh, they're playing over there, actually. They're playing table tennis. So we're at a table tennis uh, lounge and bar. Um, so uh, actually, last question. Uh, please tell the audience, because they might want to follow you on all, um, any social media platforms you, uh, you have. Yeah, uh, I have Instagram and Facebook. Uh, you guys can follow me for the, uh, you can search Wu Yue Table Tennis. Okay, yeah. for both Instagram and Facebook. So follow her. Um, last, I guess last last question. Um, can you show us a little bit like your basically your skills? Yeah, um, sure. We we kind of want to take you on. We want to want to play you. So yeah. is that all right? Yeah, yeah, sure. Teach us a couple things. Okay. Please explain a little bit really quick before we get started. You know. Oh <laughs> 
Doing pretty good. <laughs> that one is just short, okay? Yeah. yeah. Closer, closer. Uh, closer? Yeah. yeah. I'll just double bounce on my side. This side goes that way. Okay, really? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> good, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm already starting. This side goes that way. Yes, okay. No, I mean, when you touch the ball, the ball goes that way. I, I couldn't even see it anyways. Okay, you saw that come. Come on, dude. Again, yeah. Good. Good. Another one. At this rate, we're going to have a lot of cleaning up to do. So, Miss Wooj, he said earlier today that he could totally beat you. <laughs> oh, no. He said that, that to me earlier today. <laughs> Last one.